How you doing? Welcome to my channel. My name is Bobby. I know I wear the same gear all the time, but check this out. My hair, I just cut it. Yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna either let it, I'm gonna just grow it out and do ponytail, or I'm just gonna shave it all off. But yikes, right? And I did this with just a little tiny trimmer. I was like, yeah. Anyway, long story short, this video is gonna be simple. <sighs> it's gonna be about children. And they used to have orphanages and places like that for children to go when their parents were passed away or their parents are suffering from like drug addictions or whatever. And we have, what do they have? That um, a Child Protection Agency, CPS or whatever, which is an absolute fucking nightmare. And I don't trust any of them. And I've heard some of the stories that come out of the CPS. They're just, they take kids away from their families and give them to what perverts and stuff who knows I don't know these children are vulnerable because you, they're not only have the parents that they that they're supposed to be protecting them and keeping these kids safe or losing their shit and doing stupid shit and just ignoring the fact that those child should be go coming first before their own addictions and their crap and they're humping their boyfriends or whatever or getting their nails done these children come first and people are slipping hard. And I don't want to go into it, but I'm seeing kids homeless with parents. And I'm like, it's, it hurt my heart. And I'm like, and I'm hearing about people get going to jail because of stupid shit. And their kids going to CPS. And, and, I'm, and all I could think about is we need places for children. Like a YMCA for kids. That's it. I want to start. YMCA's for kids and it'll be a center and it'll be in all towns every every city should have one every town should have one especially a big enough town you know what I mean and it's just a building it's like a center but for kids only and if you and the kids traumatized kids orphaned kids can and they can live in the facility they can stay there safely they're protected they have security they'll have nurse on staff that kind of thing and you know, so that way the children and the and teachers, they can have even classrooms so they can learn while they're in there. These are kids that are suffering and going through it and having a hell of a fucking time. And they need help and they need some semblance of normalis, I don't know, normalcy. I don't know if that's a fucking word. Look, I grew up in chaos. I grew up with parents that were divorced and my mom was doing just whatever and anything. It was the 70s. So I was a wild child, so I was dealing with a lot of shit, and that was pretty normal for a lot of kids. But it's not normal, and it wasn't, and it wasn't a safe environment for me. And I was always in an unsafe. I was always having to be on my toes as a kid because you didn't know who was around you. It was just, you know, that kind of thing. So I understand what that's like. And I just, I mean, when it comes to children, man, that's it's one thing for adults to be just destroying themselves and to be, and it hurts my heart enough because they don't love themselves. But kids, man, you got, you can't. You can't. They're 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 innocent. They're, I don't even know where to begin. Right? It's, it's a whole new. I'm I'm just rambling. I'm sorry. I just think it's important. We need to save the kids. Keep them safe from perverts and politicians and and parents that are more concerned about doing drugs and their own children's happiness and. And safety and security and I don't know we'll work this out this is just me this is just a footnote for me later on maybe when I meet Elon Musk and we we ramble about some stuff and I got ideas and like yeah YMCA is for kids orphaned and kids going through so so CPS when they have to take kids away from if cops have to show up and take kids somewhere parents die in an accident whatever anything like that and they don't have anybody these are centers they can go to and it's a safe space they'll have people that are trauma you know counselors they'll have like teddy bears uh, soft beds they were like baths they can you know what i mean clothes we're gonna work on this this is just like i said i'm spitball i'm sorry but yeah i had to get it out this is gonna be the video and i'm gonna get the hell out of here um we need to protect the kids. YMCA for kids. And I'm going to go. Okay, I love you. God loves you. And the universe loves children and wants to protect them. Okay. Love you. Bye.